Meet Ella and Rona, two best friends who have been inseparable since they were kids. They go to the same school and share the same passion for art. But they are about to face challenges that will test their friendship and their identity. Hi Anna, have you heard about the new gender policy in the Yeah, I've heard about it. It's about under rights. I know, right? But some people still don't get it. They think it's weird or wrong to get it. Yes, I just wanted to talk to you about the relationship with her. What are you talking about? You know, Mika, I'm not against on your relationship with her, but I'm just concerned about your mental health. Why? Well, it been the people remember when you were with Sarah, and it was really toxic. It took a toll on your mental health, and I don't want to see that happen again with Ella. What's wrong, Ella? My girlfriend broke up with me because her father can't accept our relationship. She said she couldn't afford to lose her father. I'm sorry, Ella. That sucks. But you know what? Screw her. You are who you are and you don't need anyone's approval. I made this because I want to show that gender identity is not black and white. Wow! That's amazing! It's a spectrum, and everyone has the right to express themselves the way they want. You really captured the essence of what I'm going through. Why can't people just accept me for who I am? Why do they have to judge me based on my gender identity? Ella's painting became a symbol of hope and acceptance for everyone who experienced discrimination based on their gender identity. They showed that art can be a powerful tool to raise awareness and promote equality. As what Ella said in her lines, gender identity is not black or white, it is a spectrum and everyone has the right to express themselves the way they want. We all have the freedom to express ourselves the way we want it to be. <laughs> 